Hi, it's Nick on the 24th of November uh, with the fifth episode of this week's theme of the power of validation. So today I'm touching on the idea that I think it's very powerful, you know, and it sounds paradoxical, but actually to validate the people that we don't agree with. Because I think, you know, so much of what goes on is about trying to invalidate somebody else's position. You know, whether we're in politics, whether we're in a relationship or in a family or at work, often we're trying to invalidate it, uh, the other person's position, tell them why they're wrong and they shouldn't feel like that and they shouldn't think like that. I think there's something very powerful in, in being able to say to somebody, I can understand why you think like that. I can understand why you would feel that. Because that's validating their thinking and validating their feeling, but it's not necessarily agreeing with them but it's an agreeing with why they would think like that or why they would feel like that. And I think there's tremendous power in doing that. Um, I know there have been people that I've disagreed with or I've had you know, conflict with, and when they validated what I was thinking and feeling, that was very powerful for me. And I know that when I've done that for other people, even if I've disagreed with them, I've validated why they would think what they think and I've validated why they would feel like they would feel. And I think it's often helped diffuse situations because, yeah, people feel heard. And I think there is the, this power to validation that we've touched on this week, which is, you know, you can, I, be, I believe you can validate without agreeing. You can have diametrically opposed views to somebody and you can still validate their thinking and feeling without saying, I agree with what you're thinking and feeling but I, would under, I do understand why you're thinking and feeling like you are. And that is, I think, one of the f important steps to bringing people together and for mutual understanding. Um, so, yeah, today's idea is that we can validate people that we don't agree with um, without telling them that we think they're right, but we can tell them that we understand where they're coming from. And I think there's tremendous power in doing that. Okay, hope that's helpful. Have a good day. God bless. Bye-bye.